The human genome contains 20,000 genes, and every cell in the body contains two sets of these genes. One gene copy is inherited from your mother, and one copy is inherited from your father. Mutations can occur in these gene copies that cause cells in the body to develop or function abnormally, leading to health problems. Scientists have generally thought that when a mutation occurs in only one gene copy, the remaining healthy copy can often compensate for the defect in each cell. However, new research from the Gregg Lab at the University of Utah is revealing a different picture. The Gregg Lab's research indicates that for many genes, a subpopulation of cells in the body express only one of the two copies, and the other copy is turned off. Therefore, when a mutation occurs, there is no healthy backup to compensate. These findings contribute to a new picture of disease genetics at the cellular level, in which some cells in the body are especially vulnerable to the effects of mutations because they turned off their healthy gene copy. The Gregg Lab hypothesizes that these high-risk cell populations may be playing important roles in human disorders and diseases, including neurodevelopment disorders such as autism. The lab is now focused on understanding these effects and developing therapeutic strategies to turn on healthy gene copies where they are needed.